yards. Three year olds and upward going 400 yards. Online tonight is a berth into the Champion of Champions for the winning connections. The $1 million Champion of Champions to be run here at Los Alamitos in December. Post time for the ninth race in seven minutes at 10.28. We now introduce the outstanding field at Phillies and Mares for the Mildred Vessels Memorial Handicap. The winner of this year's Charger Bar Handicap is number one, What a Performance. Owned by Felix A. Gonzalez and trained by Adan Farias, the rider Rodrigo Aceves. And number two is Strength in Numbers, who is owned by Benny Rossette and trained by Paul Jones, being piloted by Cesar D'Alba. The defending champion is number three, A Political Time. It was owned by Juan Alberto Torado Lizarraga and trained by Juan Alleman, being handled by Ramon Sanchez. Number four, Corona Crystal, is leased by Armando Leon and trained by Paul Jones during the riding, Alex Batista. Number five is Mia Jones, who is owned by Kay Larson and trained by Paul Jones in the saddle, jockey Alejandro Luna. The champion two-year-old of 2006, the winner of this year's Golden State Derby, is number six, Blues Girl Tail. Owned by the Lucky Seven Ranch and trained by Joe Bassett, being ridden by Saul Ramirez. And number seven is Isaac Country Miss. Owned by the Raptor SM Ranch and trained by Sparky Mullins, the jockey G.R. Carter. The winner of this year's Vessels Maturity is number eight, Five Bar Molly. Owned by Arigal Choice Incorporated and trained by Adan Farias, the rider Juan Andrade. Number nine is Hold Me Now. Owned by Jose Gonzalez and trained by Hector Jaime Hernandez, the rider J.R. Ramirez. And the runner-up in the Mildred Vessels Memorial Handicap last year is number 10, Blaze and Fire. Owned by Dan or Lisa McMahon and trained by Paul Jones. And doing the riding is Cody Jensen. Here's the defending champion, A Political Time, Ramon Sanchez, about ready to walk in. And now five bar Motley, the senior citizen of the field, has gone into the gate with Juan Andrade, the winner of this year's Vessels Maturity. Corona Crystal will be the next one up. We have three left allowed as Hold Me Now, ready to come to the gate. And Mia Jones and Blaze and Fire will start from the far outside. As plays and fire, about ready to complete the field. Everybody's standing perfect at this point. And now blaze and fire to go in. They're all on the gate. And away they go. And a good start for A Political Time and Blues Girl 2. Also, Five Bar Motley came away well down along the inside as Water Performance. Blazing Fire to the extreme outside as Blues Girl 2. The one to beat A Political Time and Water Performance and Five Bar Molly. But how good is this three-year-old Blues Girl 2? She crushes the field in the Mildred Missiles Memorial Handicap. A Political Time, strength in numbers, Five Bar Molly, Water Performance. But Blues Girl 2, the performance of her life tonight, she beats the older horses and she crushes them. Certainly prominent in the quarter horse industry throughout the country. 
in the winter circle to make the trophy presentation to the winning owner is her son Scoop Vessels as Scoop's presence in the quarter horse industry continues to be very visible as Scoop Vessels is the of course runs the Vessel Stallion Farm down in Bonsville, California and he and Ed Allred will be hosting the Los Alamitos equine sale here among the top quarter horse sales in the country in two weeks. Scoop Vessels is making the trophy presentation. And now returning to the winner's circle victorious in the Mildred Vessels Memorial Handicap and getting a berth into the $1 million champion of champions and equaling the 400-yard track record in the process is number six, Blues Girl 2, who is owned by the Lucky 7 Ranch and trained by Joe Bassett, the winning rider, Saul Ramirez. Blues Girl 2 is the three-year-old filly bred in Texas by the Lucky 7 Ranch and is by Corona Cartel out of Run the Dash. Once again, the winning time for the 400 yards, equaling the track record, 19.30 seconds, and the final 220 yards in 9.29 seconds. Race 9 is official. Here is the $1 exact combination, number 6 and 3, for a payoff of $15.20. The $1 trifecta, 6, 3, and 2, paying $120.10. And here are the superfecta, 6, 3, 2, and 1, $479.40. And 6, 3, 2, and 8, $365. Post time for the 10th and final race in 15 minutes. Post time.